Charophyta is a group of freshwater green algae, sometimes treated as a division, but also as a superdivision, or an unranked clade. The terrestrial plants, the embryophyta emerged within Charophyta, possibly with the class Zygnematophyceae as a sister group. The embryophyta most likely originated from terrestrial unicellular caryophytes. With the cladistic inclusion of the embryophyta, the charophyta is synonymous with the streptophyta. The sister group of the caryophytes are the chlorophyta. In some caryophyte groups, such as the zygnematophyceae or conjugating green algae, flagella are absent and sexual reproduction does not involve free-swimming flagellate sperm. Flagellate sperm, however, are found in stoneworts, chirals, and coleocattails, orders of parenchymatous caryophytes that are the closest relatives of the land plants, where flagellate sperm are also present in all except the conifers and flowering plants. Fossil stoneworts of Devonian age that are similar to those of the present day have been described from the Rhiney Chert of Scotland. Classification Charophyta are complex green algae that form a sister group to the chlorophyta and within which the embryophyta emerged. The chlorophyte and caryophyte green algae and the embryophytes or land plants form a clade called the green plants or viridiplantae, that is united among other things by the absence of phycobilans, the presence of chlorophyll B and chlorophyll A cellulose in the cell wall and the use of starch, stored in the plastids, as a storage polysaccharide. Unlike chlorophytes, the caryophytes and embryophytes share several traits, such as the presence of certain enzymes class 1 aldolase, Cu, Zn superoxide dismutase, glycolate oxidase, flagellar peroxidase, lateral flagella when present, and, in many species, the use of framoplasts in mitosis. Thus charophyta and embryophyta together form the clade streptophyta, excluding the chlorophyta. Caryophytes such as Paleonitella crani and possibly the yet unassigned Parca discipiens are present in the fossil record of the Devonian. Paleonitella differed little from some present-day stoneworts. Cladogram Below is a consensus reconstruction of green algal relationships, mainly based on molecular data. The phylogeny is not entirely uncontroversial. The placement of the basal green algae, Mesostigmatophyceae, Spiratinia, and Chlorochibophyceae, is more conventionally at the base of streptophytes. Basal streptophytes are filamentous, while Mesostigmatophyceae and Chlorochibophyceae are not. Description the Zygnematophyceae or, as they used to be called, Conjugatophyceae, generally possess two fairly elaborate chloroplasts in each cell, rather than many discoid ones. They reproduce asexually by the development of a septum between the two cell halves or semi-cells in unicellular forms, each daughter cell develops the other semi-cell afresh and sexually by conjugation, or the fusion of the entire cell contents of the two conjugating cells. The saccoderm desmids and the placoderm or true desmids, unicellular or filamentous members of the Zygnematophyceae, are dominant in non-calcareous, acid waters of oligotrophic or primitive lakes e.g. wastewater, or in lochins, tarns and bogs, as in the west of Scotland, era, parts of Wales and of the Lake District, Klebsormidium, the type of the Klebsormidiophyceae, is a simple filamentous form with circular, plate-like chloroplasts, reproducing by fragmentation, by dorsoventral, biciliate swarmers and, according to Will, a 20th century algologist, by Aplanos pores. The same source states that sexual reproduction is simple and isogamous, the gametes are outwardly identical without a distinct male and female, at least to look at. The various groups included in the charophyta have diverse and idiosyncratic reproductive systems, sometimes with complex reproductive organs. The unique habit among the algae of protecting the overwintering zygote within the tissues of the parent gametophyte is one of several characteristics of coleocattails that suggest that they are a sister group to the embryophytes. The chirals or stoneworts are freshwater algae with slender green or gray stems. The gray color of many species results from the deposition of lime on the walls, masking the green color of the chlorophyll. The main stems are slender and branch occasionally. Lateral branchlets occur in whorls at regular intervals up the stem, they are attached by rhizoids to the substrate. The reproductive organs consist of antheridia and ogonia, though the structures of these organs differ considerably from the corresponding organs in other algae. As a result of fertilization a protonema is formed, from which the sexually reproducing algae develops. 
Carophytes are frequently found in hard water with dissolved calcium or magnesium carbonates. They tolerate low concentrations of salt, and are found in the inner reaches of the Baltic Sea and in tropical brackish lagoons but not in marine environments. The water must be still, or only slow flowing, oligotrophic or mesotrophic and little pollution due to sewage. The Charophyceae are obligate aquatic algae, growing submerged in calcareous fresh water. They are distributed throughout the world from the tropics to cold temperate zones. Six genera are recognized. Chara Lamprothamnium Lichnothamnus Nutella Nutellopsis Tolipella Cell structure there are numerous small discoid chloroplasts, which are disposed around the periphery of the cells. No pyrenoids are present. The large internodal cells are sometimes multinucleate, and their nuclei often possess large nucleoli and scanty chromatin. In these cells the cytoplasm forms only a peripheral layer with a large central vacuole. The cell walls are composed of cellulose, though there may be also a superficial layer of a more gelatinous material of unknown composition. The storage material is starch, except in the oospore, where oil also occurs. This starch also accumulates in special storage structures, termed bulbils, which consist of rounded cells of varying size which are developed in clusters on the lower stem and root nodes. They are mainly developed when the algae are growing in fine slimy mud. Cytoplasmic streaming was first demonstrated in the giant cells of Chara internodes by Giovanni Battista Amicai, in 1818. Sexual reproduction The reproductive organs of the chorales show a high degree of specialization. The female organ is a large oval structure with an envelope of spirally arranged, bright green filaments of cells. It is termed an ugonium. The male organ is also large, bright yellow or red in color, spherical in shape, and is usually termed an antheridium, though some workers regard it as a multiple structure rather than a single organ. The sex organs are developed in pairs from the adaxial nodal cell at the upper nodes of the primary lateral branches, the ugonium being formed above the antheridium. They are sufficiently large to be easily seen with the naked eye, especially the bright orange or red antheridium. Many species are dioecious. In others the monoecious condition is complicated by the development of the antheridium before the formation of the ugonium, thus preventing fertilization by antherozoids of the same alga. In this case the two types of sex organs usually arise from different points on the lateral branches. Vegetative propagation Vegetative propagation occurs readily in the chorales. Secondary protonemata may develop even more rapidly than primary ones. Fragments of nodes, dormant cells of algae after hibernation or the basal nodes of primary rhizoids may all produce these secondary protonemata, from which fresh sexual algae can arise. It is probably this power of vegetative propagation which explains the fact that species of Shiraceae are generally found forming dense clonal mats in the beds of ponds or streams, covering quite large areas. References External links Data related to Charophyta at Wikispecies